All right, hello everybody and welcome to Mini Shoot Adventures. This is a Legend of Zelda like um bullet hell, which is just like such a cool combination. Uh it's 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 really neat. I'm super interested to check this out. It's coming out on April 2nd and uh, yeah, this is a two person team that made this game and it looks really polished. So I'm excited to give it a go. Uh I I'm just getting into it right now, so we're going to just quickly look over the, the graphics and the options and all that. I'm going to turn the screen flashes down for your all's sake. Down to like a 10%. That seems good. And uh, let's go ahead and do a quick sound check. Ooh, we've, oh, we've got difficulties. Okay. Okay. There's accessibility as well. You can change the, the games. There we go. That's, that's, is it, wait, is it set to 50%? Interesting. I, I want to make sure it's at 100% when I get into the game. Um, but yeah. I've recently been wetting my whistle with um, bullet hells again in the form of tiny rogues, which I, I think is like a really nice integration of a bullet hell. And uh, yeah, I, I am excited to see this genre kind of starting to pop off more because, uh, you know, there, there's just something about it. It's really satisfying dodging a bunch of bullets, you know. So we've got uh, recommended if you're looking for a challenging yet still accessible top down gameplay shooter. Recommended if you're accustomed to top-down shooters or would like more tension in combat, faster enemies, and faster bullets. I'm going to go for advanced. Uh, I'm a gamer. Uh, feel free to play on whatever difficulty you want, but I'm, I'm going gamer mode. And uh, yeah, I'm, I'm excited to give this a go. It seems really interesting um, that there, there's all these bullet hells that aren't like shmups now. And uh, I want to I wanna see... Uh, what this game has to offer, because it seems really, really cool. So you can see we got all these little ships. Oh my god, one of them got lasered. Um, oh shit, okay. Alright, I wonder if that one's me. Also, this one is a, uh, a twin stick shooter, so it recommended me uh, using a controller over all the other options. I would have gotten keyboard mouse for superior aim, but... They really wanted me to use a controller, so I'm going to. Wake up, little one. The corruption has emerged. The unchosen is back. Alright. Search for your shipling friends. Retrieve my primordial powers and restore balance to the Great Crystal. Alright. Ooh. <laughs> the movement feels good. Oh, that's nice. Yes. Oh, okay. Water. I don't even fly. Fall into water. We got We got our bullets. Our first bullets going down. I can't shoot yet. It seems. Um, that's chill. Yeah, this game's got a great art style. It's really, really cool looking. Yeah, so despite being a little, little ship guy, we cannot fly, which is interesting. Ah, here we go. The weapon of legend. The blaster. Okay, cool, 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 cool. So, oh, this is a one-way. Ah, uh, look at that. That's clever. Okay. It's a little, little Pokemon-y almost. Uh, getting all the achievements already. But yeah, in case anybody's wondering what this is going to be, this is literally just a, a blind let's play. Um, I'm just going to play the game and enjoy it. Because it looks friggin' sick, and uh, you can be the judge on whether you're interested or not. We're just gonna hang out and enjoy Vigi game, you know? So we're getting these little gem rolls that are piling up in the top left there. They've got physics to them up in the top left, which is super cute. Kind of love that. I see a secret on the, the right there, so we're gonna go for that for sure. Yeah, I... Listen, I've, I've played video games, alright? But now I'm extra curious if there's any other stuff that I've missed. <laughs> Can I... Oh, look at that. Okay, so the ramp, you cannot, like, shoot over. That makes sense. So we're, we're, we're getting a simple start so far. They're just getting us started. The the thing about twin twin stick shooters is, like, they, they practically don't exist anymore. Like, other than the super odd one, unless you're into, like, the super niche stuff. Um, but it, this, I could see something like this becoming mainstream, where, where they take, like, uh, they take the bullet hell genre and they, they really, you know, put it, put it somewhere a little bit more exciting than, like, just, you know, going down a, a space hallway. 
Okay, let's see how we do here. So there's little spikes that appeared around my my screen, and I think that's to signify that we're locked in this room, which is cool. Um, after this fight, I'm going to check and see if the game speed is at 100%, because, I, I mean, it, it'll make the game much harder if I speed it up any more than this, but I, I want to see. Um, it is at 100%, perfect, okay. And, oh, maybe that's what that stuff is, is it's... Um, it's energy. So manual aiming with the right stick or mouse. Uh, automatically aims and shoots when an enemy is near. That's kind of nice. That's kind of nice, because you can focus on the bullets then. I think these are all really great. Uh, orient your ship towards enemies to shoot. Assisted. I, th I think we're just going to go with manual, because uh, that... that I, li I like uh, the... There's something really fun about trying to shoot and aim at the the same time or sorry aim and dodge at the same time there we go okay so that that's crystallized and that's a le there's level ups i was not expecting level ups in this game we can upgrade mini shoot with y oh my god we got a we got some skill trees and stuff this looks really cool so we can we can downgrade at any time too look at that okay that's sweet so we we can just like pick one of these for now this one requires two cost. Um, fire rate tends to be, like, really good. We can just put one in fire rate, and then we can place it in a damage up once we uh, level up. Um, fire rate and fire range. Fire range is also pretty nice. Let's go for fire rate for now, and then when we get another level up, we'll replace it into damage. That seems good to me. Okay. Oh, this is the this is the guy from the cutscene, right? Oh man, they're they're pretty messed up. I should probably follow them. Gun level two. I need five of that red resource, but I don't have any of it yet. Which is good to know. So I wonder if there's gonna be branching paths or if we can like if there if there's gonna be one way. So that I know this game's gonna have some exploration aspects to it because, you know, Zelda is What's, what's in here? Ooh, we got a fight already. Okay. Let's see how we manage. Yeah, but uh, anyway, one, one of the things that I was going to say. Uh, these episodes are going to be probably, like, really long. Because I just want to really dig in on this game. And try to get as much of it completed as I can. And, uh... Yeah, just in, in, in time for release. And uh, I figure just like a couple big videos would be really nice. I, I have no idea how much gameplay is in this one. But these, these guys are awful. I'm going to deal with them right away. Oh, man. Oh, we've been hit. There's our first hit, bit of damage. We like... Oh, there's our second hit of damage. we got to be careful. All right. I don't know how we heal yet. We'll have to figure that out. Hopefully... Okay, so we, we heal by just getting that stuff so this doesn't open up it looks like i'm supposed to light these torches with something and that'll open up the door um that that's that's where my my brain goes with that so let's go back up here i wonder if i can heal or anything this is where we came from so we're not going to bother with that but yeah no healing no healing just yet We've got this path on the left and got just some random rogue dudes. Now, I, I do have a confession to make, by the way. In case you're you're not super savvy with my, my game history, I'm actually uh, not super Zelda-pilled. Like, I, 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 I had a good time with Zelda as a kid, but I, I never was able to complete any of the games because I've got a, stu a dumb, stupid brain that's really bad at puzzles. Especially when it's like, oh yeah, take this puzzle piece to another part of the world. That shit's super hard for me. Um, so, yeah, I've, I've never completed a Zelda game. I've played Ocarina of Time, I've played um, Four Swords, I've played uh, one of the Game Boy ones that I can't remember the name of, but it's it's it, it generally a universally beloved one. Um, but yeah, I've never managed to beat any. Oh, this guy, this guy looks like he should be my friend. Oh my god, I'm so screwed, man. I should, this is, this is, you never should have come here, energy. This is big, you never should have come here, energy. 
Oh my gosh. And uh, bed. Yep, here we go. Well, now we've got our first death. My poor child, you cannot give up now. The unchosen must be stopped, even if you must defy finitude itself. Okay, so what happens? Does it spawn me at the start of the room, or does it send me back a ways? Okay, so it, sp it sends me back here. So let's uh, let's take another different path. Um, but yeah, I've never completed a Legend of Zelda game, but that doesn't mean that uh, I didn't enjoy myself playing them, you know? It's, it's, it's one of those things. But hopefully I can complete this. This seems really cool. And, you know, I've, I've got an adult brain now, so hopefully that's that's going to be better than my uh, less good child brain <laughs> that could never complete any of those Zelda games. Uh. This is definitely... Uh, I played a little bit of the um, the first Legend of Zelda more recently, actually. And it's funny because uh, some of the this, like, layout... Uh, really tink it like tickles my brain and, and it, it remember I'm remembering little bits and pieces it feels like I've, I've seen some of these before like the the enemies popping out of water and stuff which is cool Let's see if we can get these little little red guys that's another level up for us I do believe indeed uh, so let's go ahead and oh we got another one wait was move speed already unlocked? Maybe. Okay, so we're going to downgrade this and put it into that. And we, we got an achievement for doing that. Um, second thoughts, which is cool. We got Bhutan, which is going to lead us home. So, so far the, the controls in this game are very simple, which I can appreciate. I, I think um, having like a simple control scheme is pretty sick. I'm interested to see how many more buttons get involved. But I know one, one of my... Uh, one of my favorite games in terms of like design is like Kirby Air Ride. That game has like really, really cool design where it's like you only need two buttons to control a whole game. And that's counting the Oh my goodness. That's counting the the thumbstick as a button. And I'm I'm sure even that's a bit of a stretch. But it's it's pretty cool. Okay. Gonna gonna get in the groove here. It's all about aggression. But yeah, in terms of other, like, bullet hells that I've played, uh, you know, there, there, there's Tiny Rogues. I played Jamestown when I was uh, much younger. That was an interesting game. We got, we got like, a piece of cheese here. I think this might be, like, a piece of map or something. Let's see. Ooh, okay, okay. Yeah, that was a piece of map. And now it kind of shows me where it wants me to go next, to that, uh, that boss over there. A nice little spin. I love that. But yeah, no Nova Drift, Jamestown, um Near Automata, sometimes I guess, is a bullet hell. <laughs> the the list is short. The list is pretty short. But yeah, I'm I'm loving the vibes of this game. This is sick. And uh, I, I hope to see oh wow, that guy split in two. That was interesting. Uh, I'm hoping to see some cool uh, like various upgrades that you can get, and uh, yeah, I, w I wonder if there's going to be, or how they're going to do like progression. I, g I guess just like stronger bullet is the easy way, but I could see like a, you know, like a big dash coming into play, and it's the, you know, there, there's there's lots of potential. Let's see what uh, see what they've got in this puppy. But yeah, this this uh, right right now it is the. Let's see. March 19th. <laughs> so this, this game's uh, coming out next month, I think. I'm not really good at the months, but yeah, it's it's some exciting stuff. Yeah, I'm so glad that I was able to get a hold of this a little early. It's been pretty fun so far. Okay, let's jump into the, the boss here. Oh, wait, do we have the resources to get this upgrade? Nope, we've only got one. Only got one. I, w I bet if we explored more thoroughly, we might be able to do that. But I want to get in on this boss fight, or whatever this path is. Oh, this isn't the boss. That's like the final. That's the final zone. They're teasing me. They're teasing the noobs, as they say. Ooh, spicy. A little bit of a spicy walk there. I really like the the physicality of the level up system in the top left. That's a that's a super cute little aspect. 
Um, I, I note that I am notorious for getting lost in Vidya. So, uh, oh, I'm... <laughs> yeah, that happened. That certainly happened. Uh, it's okay. We, we face tanked one shot so that way we can have like a safe spot to hang out. And these guys are dropping that good good. Look at that. Don't mind if I did. And we got an extra heart right away as well, which is nice. It's like we didn't take damage at all. Whoops, I keep hitting the wrong button. Um, I wonder what the, what the speed run of this game will look like. Do you think they'll take movement speed? Let's check how fast movement speed is. Hmm, it is faster. It's not the most noticeable extra speed, but it is faster. Can I change my stats in battle? Oh man, I can. Look at that. That's very interesting. I wonder... Oh! Because you can change your stats on the fly... So, I'm not planning on speedrunning this game necessarily, but I always love to speculate um, what the speedrun will look like. And uh, being able to, to like do uh, like this... If, if you got fast at menuing, you could, you could just like take your movement speed while you're wandering around and then swap it back uh, in combat. That's so cool. That's a cute little optimization. Oh, Busto! Hell yeah, dude. Oh, that's nice. I love that. Wait, what? what's the resource? Is it infinite or is there a resource? Oh! Okay, so it's it's a physical resource. Take a look at the blue. You can see that it depletes. And these things increase the, the resource. Okay, that's cool. I'm gonna go right, because this is definitely secret. Oh man, I don't know if I can make that jump. Let's let's try it. Nope! <laughs> I, I need a stronger boost. I need a stronger boost for that one. Okay. Now, I wonder if speed increases the boost or not. I'm not sure if it does. Okay, these guys can have multiple angles, which is interesting. Does this open both of those paths up? It does. Maybe this isn't fi a final boss, Andy. Maybe this is the just the first boss and we need the, the boost power up to get here. It's one of those things. Sometimes it's hard to, to tell. Okay, so this these little things are respawn points. Okay, so th this is our first dungeon. Um, classic Zelda stuff. All right, here we go. It's boss fighting or just room fighting time, I guess. So yeah, I can use the boost in combat, which is nice. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, let's see, boosts. Oh, you got boost speed too. Okay, okay. I wonder if bullet speed increases range or not. Probably not. Let's go with fire rate this time. I wanna, wow, that feels substantial. Oh, these corners. <laughs> Dude, if I'm struggling already, getting hit already, that's that's a scary thing. Like, <laughs> I need to get better at video game. I mean, that's that's why we're playing bullet hell. You know, that's why we're playing on uh, on a high difficulty so we can improve our our. Our gaming prowess. You know, it's it's cool to play a genre that you don't play much and get better at it, right? It's part of the fun. I'm I'm really feeling the, the movement speed difference now between like the, the low and high movement speed. Okay. Good, good. Nice. So they they've got cover. I assume I wouldn't be able to shoot through that. Yeah. There we go. Continue working on that level up. We are missing one heart still. And we've got a key, but we're going to have to fight for it. Okay, so we've got our first melee enemies popping up now. So, that's... Oh my goodness. So the thing about melee enemies in a, a bullet hell is that they, their presence do, doesn't go away like a like a bullet will. So they, they tend to be a pretty high priority enemy. Um, but, I, of course, in bullet hell, like, enemy prioritization is always uh, kind of a tricky thing. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> They're all coming at me. So one, one thing I'm realizing is, uh, corner strats are huge against melee enemies like this. Because, like, what are they going to do? Run into the wall? Love that. 
Love that. That was some gaming. The boost is really coming in handy. We've got our first key, which is very nice. Very pleased about that. And we'll have to keep an eye out for secrets. If you see any, any like, secrets that I missed, uh, feel free to comment them. Of course, may maybe by the time I've, I've played, or maybe by the time I've, I've uh, uploaded the video, I'll have completed the whole game. We'll see. Um, there we go. Nice. So that's enough of that red stuff to upgrade my gun to level 2. And that's yet another level up. I'm going to put that in a range right away because these guys are in an awkward spot. And that's going to make my life so much easier. Look at that. The combat leveling is actually super nice. A lot of games wouldn't let you do that sort of thing. It'd lock you out of that menu. But not this game. It's pretty interesting. Pretty interesting design choice. I wonder if that's going to be... Or how abusable that's going to be. We'll see. Looks like we're going to be able to access that key. And the secret path opened up as well. Quote unquote secret. Maybe this one's like supposed to be. Oh yeah, you can you can go th these ways. These are things. Let me take a sip here. Okay, so there are or there is no dungeon map yet. Maybe there will be soon. This is looks like a battery. Maybe that'll increase the amount of boost I have. Yeah, look at that energy max up. Very nice. And you could see that it looked like it was about, like, 20% or something, which is cool. I'm gonna go ahead and murder the rest of these dudes first. It looks like the bullets have some slight homing, potentially, the way they curve around enemies on, a, on occasion. I wonder how that works. That's something I can't access yet. But maybe we go loop around and to acquire that. So we've got another key location. We do have two keys, so... I think I'm going to go the right way first, as opposed to up. Because up feels very main pathy to me. Despite being, uh, like, through that overhang. So yeah, we'll, we'll see. Ouch. The extra range feels great, but um, I definitely need to stay on... Oh my god, I need to stay on point. I, like, I, I have to get close because I, I don't have the, the greatest range. But obviously that lowers my reaction time, especially with these super fast bullets. There we go. We got two health out of that, which is super nice. Very happy about that. And we've got even more of these red resources. So this looks like it may have been bonus. But I am all for it. I love finding all the weird little secret spots. It's very fun. There we go. <clears throat> Let me throw my... Oh, I wasn't paying close enough attention. That's... Hey, look at that. You don't take fall damage. That's good to know. That's actually really good to know. You can just kind of yeet into pits. Okay, well, there's this path, and then there's the... This path over here. I'm going to go this way first. Oh, I already did this one, didn't I? Didn't I? Alrighty. Well, I guess we're... Throwing that key in there. And it looks like we don't quite have access to that just yet. We do have this pathway over here. This is going to be a scary spot to be. Oh my goodness. <laughs> okay. It really... That, that, that was a, a failure of knowing where to go on my part. That's that's entirely my B. But, uh, yeah, I gotta, I gotta, like, learn my hitbox and learn how to, like, not just try to do the, the kiting circles. Because, obviously, once you start uh, playing a bullet hell properly, you're dodging in between the bullets, not just trying to kite them. Uh, that I feel like kiting in video games is, is just, like, so universal and so less, so much less brain engaging than, like, having to stop and, like, weave in between things. Um... It's one of those things where, you know, it makes your brain feel pretty good, but I'm, I'm ready for a bigger challenge, I think. But, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm excited to see how this game scales up in difficulty. So far, it's already at, like, a really good spot for me. Feeling good. Going down every now and then. Ooh, look at that. A little, little bit of hitbox shenanigans there. Look good. Here we go. Another cube. Cube. Yeah. 
cash. Oh, we've got a... It's, this is a Souls-like? Mini-shoot adventures is a Souls-like? <laughs> I'm, I'm just kidding. Kind of. <laughs> kind of. This looks fun. Okay, that guy can't be slain. I do love a little a little dash. Okay, let's blast this guy. The range has been super nice, by the way. Probably my favorite upgrade that I've gotten so far. So I, I wonder if the dash grants iframes. Oh my goodness, I'm so bad. Oh man, that is, uh, is a little bit of a little bit of badness going on there. That's my B. Can I aim? Oh my goodness. Okay, we're fine. Everything's fine. There's there's a lot of bullets on screen. Just get whenever there's a lot of bullets on screen, just focus on your character, and then you, you just don't get hit, right? That's how that works. Okay. There we go. One heart back, and yet another key. Don't mind if I did. Okay. So uh, just in case anybody's wondering. Uh, the buttons employed so far count is up to, to two. We've got the Y button and we've got the the LB. And then I guess menuing if you want to count that too. It's it's interesting to have the dash tied to uh Okay, where am I going? Is this is this am I going anywhere right now? I th I think this is the path I already did, right? There's gonna be like a whole bunch of new spots that I've unlocked. Like this. So, I guess this is increased max health. So I need to collect four of those. Okay, so that's, that's not a jump spot. Also, of note, that healed my missing heart. Which is cool. I think because we're pretty close to the, the home base, I'm going to go upgrade my, my thing really quick. Because uh, it's right here just right here to do that. There we go. Gun level 2. Now gun level 3 requires 22. So now I'm shooting double bullets rather than single bullet. That's cool. I wonder if we'll be able to get like side upgrades like uh, like laser and stuff. Laser and shotgun and all that sort of thing. Man, I remember one of my old SNES shmups. I don't remember what it was called, but it had some really cool upgrades in it. Okay, we can do this, but we need yet another key. And I imagine it's probably over this way. It appears that dashing doesn't... Oh my gosh! <laughs> That's a lot of dudes. Okay. We're fine, we're fine. It's it's cool. It's a good thing I went and upgraded. That probably helped my, my damage output there a lot. Otherwise, I would have been panicking even harder. I love breaking stuff. You never know when you're going to find something cool. Okay. Another level up. Nice. Oh, man. That's two level ups. Let's see if we can spend that on anything good. Um, fire rate three. Fire range two. Let's get the, the crit. And... I don't care about bullet speed yet, but that'll probably matter more later. Let's uh let's just throw the move speed on. I hang on. Does movement speed I wonder. Do you think m movement speed gets turned off when thruster gets turned on? Hmm. Those could be independent stats. I didn't really consider that. That's very fast. It's very quick indeed. Okay. Where is this leading us? Not sure yet. This game has a really nice music, too. It's good. Okay. Gotta wait on that one. Looking good. 
Dude, the, the center of this world is just a void, apparently. Oh my goodness. I should have dodged back, but I didn't. Okay. We made it. Only barely. Okay. So, I remember where this goes. I'm not super happy about my health. I feel like I'm about to go into a big fight. I'm just gonna... I'm gonna trust myself. I'm gonna trust myself to be good. Which is maybe a bad idea. But we'll see. Looks like those golden pots might heal me. That's, that's game design right there, you know? Just knowing what the, a thing is gonna do ahead of time. That's great. Okay, first boss. Derm. Okay, how many cannons we got? Six. Okay. Let's see how we do. I'm just gonna... Okay! I thought I was being clever, standing in the middle. But that is not the case. Oh! Is Dash not actually iframes? Maybe not. Okay, he's, he's he was invulnerable there for a bit. Okay, so I have to hit him in the middle, currently, I think. Or maybe, maybe not. But the wings have been damaged. Okay. There we go. It's phase two. Nice. Dude, he's got, he's got some stuff going. <laughs> okay. Hang on, I'm, I'm wasting a stat here. Uh, let's put this into fire. Oh, we've only got one level. Let's put it into, uh, bullet speed. Okay. We, we just got our first crit, I think, there. So crit chance seems pretty low by default. I'm surprised crit chance is even a stat in this. That's a, that's an interesting choice. Oh, is that it? I don't think that's quite it. Oh, okay, we've got, we've got another phase. So dashes, I don't think, have iframes. Oh, I messed up. <laughs> I messed up one second there. That's all it takes is one little screw up. That's okay. That's sick. I'm ready. I'm ready for the challenge. Yeah, normally you have, like, uh, an energy bomb to, to clear bullets once or twice in a game like this. But uh, I imagine that's probably like a later unlock. Maybe even from this boss. Okay. Just face him head on. That front facing cannon is a little scarier than all the other ones, but it's not too bad to dodge. We're just gonna focus up. Oh man. I wonder if the wings are uh, hitboxes there. Looks like they might not be. Just try to keep that damage on. But yeah, for anybody wondering what controller I'm using, I'm using a Xbox style controller. And, uh, yeah, the thumbsticks are pretty good on it. It's nice. Nobody's ever complained about a, an Xbox controller, I think. I mean, probably somebody has. <laughs> but, you know, works pretty well for me. All right, is that it? Did we get no? He's still going. He's looking pretty rough. Poor, poor ship. Me at the the midpoint of any of my FTL runs. <laughs> Just <laughs> there we go. Got him. Second try. I'll take it. I'll take a second try. <clears throat> Noise. All right. Level up. Oh. <clears throat> so you can store multiple levels. I wasn't sure about that. Sorry, my voice is it's giving out for some reason. I don't know why. Oh snap. What's this doing? <clears throat> Be defeated. That's dungeon one. And there's four dungeons. Now, <clears throat> a big door like this, that could either be the end of the game, or 
It could be the, um, what's the word? Like the midway point. That could be your Anne Orlando there, potentially, depending on how they, they do it. I have no idea which one it'll be. I would love to get that heart. <clears throat> get some heart pieces going. Um, Surely we've unlocked some new areas now. Yeah, look at that. We can go up this way. Little sad guy. Why is he sad? Okay, that didn't do anything. Hmm. So the, the boss reward was just a key. It wasn't actually a, uh, a power-up. Which is fine with me. Okay, let's go ahead and reroute some of our stats here. We're going to reduce our bullet speed and our crit chance in order to get a damage up. And I guess we'll just put that back into crit for now. Okay, so that looks like uh, the path that you take the other way. And... The next one's in the bottom left there. You can go down to go there. Let's send it. Can I make this jump? I can't do that little corner. I don't think that's going to work. Interesting. Maybe maybe this hole is where we're meant to go. I remember fighting the dudes here, but I don't think I've got the, the power to do these torches yet. Interesting. That means there's probably something somewhere else on the map that I need to explore. Uh, top right looks pretty enticing. Let's head over that way. Ooh. They, they, they dropped what looked like was something new, but I don't think it was. I just love killing guys. So this is, this is like undoubtedly the wrong way, but I just love killing guys, you know? Here we go. Zoom! Where does this take us? We are now in a new biome. A new place. I don't know if this is the intended direction, but... I'm happy to do things in what or whatever order the game presents itself to me in. Oh my goodness! <laughs> There's a lot of bullets on screen all of a sudden. <laughs> Oh, Nelly! <laughs> the bullet patterns were crazy! That's awesome! Holy shit! That was so cool! Okay. That was awesome. Dude, I wanna go do that fight again. Let's, let's get back over there. Okay. Nice little crit. Oh, I didn't make it. I, I, gotta, I gotta boost up more. There we go. Okay, let's learn how these bush tree things work. So that we fought, or we encountered like a large version of one of those. They're pretty dangerous. They're, they're bullet spread. So maybe we go after the tree first. Seeing as how it's so devastating. Let's, let's specifically go after it first, because <laughs> like, look at the size of those shots. It's crazy. Oh my god, I had nowhere left to dodge. I'm actually really happy to see there's... there's. Oh, I'm dead again. Dude, they're so strong. I suck. I suck at video game. It's okay, it's okay. We got we got this. Dude, they're, they're pulling no punches in zone 2. I love it. I wonder if I should change my, my stats around to have more range or something. I'm silly. That was a silly piece of damage that I shouldn't have taken. We'll, uh, we'll leave that tree area until we're full HP, at the very least. So let's let's look around for some other stuff. Look around for some other stuff in this blue zone. The, the, the tree land. Oh my goodness, they're dropping big, big stuff. Okay. So I think because that's metal, it's never going to die. Yep. Triangle lads. Me when I'm playing Hallbreaker in Nova Drift. Oh god. Okay. It's going good. We're, we're killing. And we're critting as well, which is nice. Another level up, huh? Nice. Okay. Uh, that 
gives us two upgrades. We could drop our fire range, potentially. Or we could just give ourselves some bullet speed. I don't know what bullet speed does. Like, I assume that's just how fast the bullet travels. That's kind of... Like, I guess enemies are probably going to be getting faster, so that maybe that'll start being more relevant. I'll just put in boost speed for, like, the passive extra speed for now. I wonder if boost speed helps you make jumps better or anything like that. Oh, I backed into that silly bush. Backed into that silly little bush. Slaughter them all. So I guess that's a ship hiding inside the bush, if I had to guess. Got what appears to be a house. And door. Hooray! I mean, not quite a door, but, you know. <laughs> it's an entrance. It's an entrance nonetheless. That's that's good enough for me. We've got lots of energy build up here, which is interesting. Hmm. I wonder if this is going to be like a runaway sequence or something. Oh my gosh. I love when games do stuff like that. That's cool. <laughs> it's fun. It's just fun. I didn't even need to have agility to do this one. Okay. We got we got our second ship we're saving. Hello. Okay. Are they following me now? Oh, do I have to get them out? Or are they do they know where to go? I don't I don't know where they went. They probably managed to get home. I assume I didn't ha I don't have to guide them. It looks like that goes to town. We should be a little careful with our lowish health. I don't, oh wow, they can fly. Shenanigans, why can they fly and I can't? Maybe I just don't have the right boosters for it. Got him. Got him. All right. That bush is a little sus, isn't it? Aha! Oh, good. Okay, so we, we've unlocked another shortcut. What does this area hold, I wonder? Got some pots. Oh, big value pots. Okay, we've got some slightly different bushes. Gonna want to make it out of this, ideally. Beautiful. Oh, they're really bushing us up. Oh my god, that one's fast. Oh, <laughs> we lived because of high frames. Okay, how do I even approach this? <laughs> I'm scared. <laughs> oh my god. The, they just barrage so hard. Okay. There we go. That was that was scary. We made it. Derm. Okay, so we need to break this wall with like probably a bomb or a charge shot or something. If I had to guess, but that was uh, still some nice little resource gain there. I wonder if there's going to be other things for me to spend those that red currency on. We'll see. This looks like boss territory potentially, or mini boss territory. With all the torches. This guy's tonky. Big tank. Okay. Cool that enemies can drop those as well. I wonder if those are one-time drops or if they're farmable. Whoopsie. I gotta be careful getting close to these shrubberies. Dangerous. Okay, those rocks are, are big bomb energy or and or charge shot once again. So I, I, I think my pr earlier prediction of that existing is, is probably going to come true. And we probably don't need to be here right now, but that's okay. I'm going to just take the opportunity to get uh, the, the bonus stuff now and we'll come back around. There we go. Alright. The tree's going to be mad, isn't it? No, I can enter the tree. Okay, okay. Uh, we did get another upgrade here, so let's go ahead and downgrade move speed and upgrade uh, 
crit chance because I want to see how crit chance scales. It's a it's a friendly. Here we go. So they cost the the red things I've been collecting contains a piece of forgotten history. So that's an ancient tablet. Uh, max energy improves crystal restoration, reducing uh, by ten percent amount needed to level up. Restoration enhancer. Is this just ten percent? XP gain? Because that seems like the sort of thing that if you were ever going to buy it, you'd want to buy it right away. I think that's what that is. I'm going to take it. Nice. What a great little jingle. Interesting that they have health. Okay, you can't, you can't attack the shopkeep, but there is a secret area behind him. Go check that out. Where does this lead us, I wonder? That's the first loading screen the game has had, by the way. Which is of note for sure. There's only one way we can go. Where is this? Is this a racetrack? <laughs> this is a racetrack, dude! Hell yeah! Oh my god, they're so fast! Okay, I'm absolutely bodied. This is so good. Oh, I love this. I I'm I'm washed though. It's it's already over. I'm gonna go wait at the start line. Uh, we, okay, let's uh let's move all our stuff, I guess. Okay. This will probably help a bit. Let's just let's just practice the the track. Okay. Dude, they were zooming. Okay. Yeah, yeah, you got me on that one. Okay, so that's the end point of the, the track. Okay, so let's wait for our thing, and here we go. You can do this. Shortcut! -y. Oh my god, the lines, the lines, they're cracked! <laughs> Let's go, dude. That's awesome, okay. Dude, I, I love when games like their own little mini games like this. It's such great design. Okay, here we go. Really gotta work on my lines. Looking all right. There we go. Got him. Win a race against a spirit. Cool. What do I get for that? Child of the Crystal. You found one of my spirits. Bring them all back to safety. And their secret tower will open. Okay, so but bonus, probably. Maybe, I don't know. Maybe, intent maybe it's a... Uh... It's not bonus. Maybe that's that's what we gotta do. But that's cool. It's very cool. Um, we'll go ahead and put our stats back where I want them. Ooh, we could just go three into damage. Let's try that. Let's try that out for a little bit. Just get those schmeedy hits in. Big damage. There we go. Alrighty. I think this leads back to the village. Oh, this is all breakable, huh? Excuse me, sir. Excuse me. Just rude. That's definitely some good damage. Here we go. Another pathway opened. Don't mind if I do. There's, there's got to be some stuff here, right? It's not just a bunch of rocks. Oh, here we go. At least got so. Oh my god, I almost went into the drink there. I, I imagine if you fall into the water during a fight, you, you probably lose the HP. Wow, that was bad dodging. Oh, I got bodied. <laughs> the, the Omega Bullet got me. Goddamn. At least I hit the button in time. Alright, so is this another place I can spend my money? Map Fragment. 
Yes, please. Speed. gonna be able to upgrade here for a while. It's gonna be quite a while, I imagine. Just getting to level two is is nice. Oh man, we we've got a. I, I didn't actually complete the shortcut, so we're gonna have to go back down. But yeah, they they did a really good job, just like making a cute little ship, you know. What a what a cute little guy, living his life. And keep in mind that there's this isn't even like the the primary whoopsie this isn't even the primary path that I was intending to go on this is just kind of the way I ended up going I gotta go back and try that uh, that really hard fight but first I want to unlock the 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 pathway oh my oh my oh my okay we're, we're dodging we're dipping we're diving When I, if, whenever I kill one, we just get another one. Okay. Should have it under control now. There we go. Go pick up that HP. We got another level up. I'll just put that in a crit because we're just damage maxing right now. That is the current objective. Just do as much damage as possible. Of course, there's many other ways I'm sure you could do this, but... You know, I just I just like doing damage. Is that so much? Is, it, is that wrong? I don't think that's wrong. Okay. Oh, <laughs> that's embarrassing. Uh. Well, I guess that's good. It's good that that's a thing. I want to go back and do that uh, ultra hard fight that we missed out on. Okay. I wonder if we can use the, um, like, the stuff as cover. It looks like they just rip right through it. Yeah, they, they destroy it themselves as well. That's cool. I wonder if at some point I'm going to have to use, a, like, a larger enemy shot to destroy, uh, like, a, a material or something. That would be cool. Be a little bit, uh, a little bit Dark Souls 2-y. Anyone remembers the, the one wall? Force of the Fallen Giants. Is it Force of the Fallen Giants? Yeah, that's the one. That's that's the one. I remember things. There we go. Nice. Another level up. Getting lots of those. Um, let's go ahead and place that one in Fire Rate, because Fire Rate is technically a DPS up. I mean, Fire Range is a DPS up too, especially since I, it's hard to stay in range in this game. I'm going after that scary fight again. I'm I'm not done. I gotta I gotta beat him. I gotta beat that tree. Here we go. This has been the hardest fight that I've encountered in the game so far. Let's see if we can do it this time. <laughs> okay, then once again, no uh, no iframes to speak of, which is a g a good thing. I just want to make that clear. That's a positive. In my eyes, because otherwise it would, you just cheese it. I died. You know, I was close that time. I was really close. The tree. If I get the tree, we're we're cooking. Oh, I somehow ended up in the, the house. It's not what I was going for. But yeah, I'm I'm really happy that there's like no like loading and it's just like a nice big world. It's cool. I wonder what kind of, what kind of shenanigans you can pull thanks to that. Ow, whoopsie. Little little damage hit there to start. I'm gonna go clear these guys out in order to hopefully recover my health. If we're lucky. There we go. That's exactly what I wanted. Perfect. Wow, I felt I feel like I've barely made that. Okay, here we go. Round whatever. I lost track. <laughs> Not sure how many. Ow. 
If we stay on this side, oh my goodness. If we stay on this... Uh, dude, 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 dude. Okay, hang on. Um, we're diverting everything into range. Um, that's, that's just... Oh, <laughs> oh my gosh. <sighs> this guy, this guy's brutal. This guy's so brutal. Holy cow. I'm going back. It's a bit of a run. I gotta say, it is a bit of a run. It's, uh, it's a little bit of a negative for me, but... I mean, you know... Get, get good and you don't have to do the run, right? Just kill him the first time. Also, there were there were some black bullets firing. I'm I'm gonna not enter in the arena fully and just have to deal with this guy. That's that's what I'm gonna try and do. Okay. Oof. A little too close range again. Really have to min max that range. Okay. Almost got him. Just gotta play it cool. Okay. Let's freaking go. Okay, so the, because I didn't, like, fully enter into the arena, these other ones didn't spawn, and I didn't get swarmed as hard, which made it a lot easier. Whoopsie. Whoopsie immediately took a hit from one of these goofy little guys. Like, the, these guys are big threats, too. Like, it's, it's not like it's just the tree, so I'm glad I did that the way I did that. Even if it was, like, a little cheesy. So something was shooting me from across the way there, across the lake. Did you see that? I don't know what it was. But, like, they, they were big black bullets. They were pretty scary. Um, okay, let's... Oh, I shouldn't have done this. <laughs> I'm like, oh, yeah, that's just... I'm confident now. I, I killed them. Easy game. It was not an easy game. Okay, we're still way out of the uh, map zone. This is the shop. Um, I wanted to buy some other stuff from this shop, so let's do that really quick. Wait, am I in the right spot? I think I'm in the right spot. I'm not. I think I saw the the race spot from in there. Okay. I gotta be careful. Okay, so leveling up doesn't heal you, by the way. That's something that I've been meaning to check, and I haven't done so yet. Gotta gotta think about all those sort of mechanics. Never know when they're gonna come into play. Zoop. Okay, here we go. Here we go. It's the shop again. Let me purchase this. So I don't know what that is yet, but it seems to be some sort of currency. Let's go ahead and make this jump. And hopefully, uh, I'm, I'm gonna like set up in front of the uh, the next dungeon. And that seems like a perfect spot to uh, to call this episode. So yeah, let me. Oh, hang on. Uh, there we go. Let me go ahead and do a save quit. That is Mini Shoot Adventures. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this uh, little first look at. We're going to be playing through this whole game, and I'm just going to upload it wholesale on the the release day. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed this segment. And uh, we'll be back with more very soon.